How do you add logo into your Facebook Live without using any OBS, without using any StreamYard or any other software? Can you guys see my screen that I'm able to add like the my logo of my company as well as at the bottom that is a hashtag I am amazing. So here's the trick. I'm going to show you the free way in order so that you're able to attach your logo in your Facebook Live. Okay, so stay tuned to the end. Hey guys, this is June because I was born in June and welcome to my amazing life today. So if let's say you haven't joined my Facebook group to get more mini masterclass, something like a tutorial like this, feel free to join at www.amazingstar.co. Let's come back to our topic on how we are able to add our company logo or all our social media handler whenever we are doing Facebook Live using our mobile app. Here's a simple hack. I want you guys to go to the link at the bottom down below here but I attach a link and I want you to click on it and it is where you'll be going to get about this uh, URL okay this URL is actually a Facebook uh, frame studio once you landed on this URL I want you guys to click on the right hand side open frame studio it is where we are going to design the frame that is so specific only we are using and then after that, whenever we're doing our Facebook Live, I want you guys to use your... Uh, I'm just going to show you how to pick it, okay? So, when you're opening your Frame Studio, this is where it is going to pop up. I want you guys to go to the Facebook camera because it's where we want to add the logo to our Facebook Live that it's being done, right? So after that, pick Upload Art. And I want you guys to... You can prepare any images that you want. But right now, I'm specifically going to upload an image where my logo is in transparent mode, okay? So, one is uploaded, I want to show you guys this. It's very huge, right? You just need to make some adjustment um, to make it smaller. So this is what I'm going to do to make it smaller. Okay, it's still too big. Okay. Okay, once you make it smaller, you can actually in place to the place that you want to input. So usually, I think it will be top right, uh, right hand side, but then do give yourself a little bit of margin over here. And in the right hand side, you're able to see like how it will look when your phone is in portrait mode and your phone is in uh, landscape mode, okay? So the next thing, uh, if let's say you want to include extra arts, you are feel free to do so. So let me just include something like a, a tagline. Um, that we are called as a hashtag amazing or you can use this idea to let's say you want to input your website maybe my website is www.junlo.co so you can do like anything you want but I really love this hashtag called hashtag I am amazing so of course I wouldn't suggest you to drag like to bottom because it will then get covered right so I will usually do it in the something like in the middle Okay, and can you guys see the right hand side here? You're able to see like how it will look. So I think this is better. It's in the middle. Okay, and of course there are some things that you can uh, play around is string with width. When you adjust this, can you guys see that there's a difference? You probably want to check it out. All right, you can check the proportion. Okay, so I think it's just fine. And I really love it like it is bigger. So that's where I'm going to input. Okay, here's the next step. I want you guys to click next. Okay, you can just write the name of this um, frame. I'll probably put uh, amazing. I'm amazing. It's just a name, so it doesn't matter what you put, okay? I'm amazing. And it's available anywhere or you can pick only in specific location for whoever is doing the Facebook Live. And I want to make it active straight away and right away. So this one, I'll probably put um, <laughs> junlo.co. Okay, and then just click next and then right now we will send it to be reviewed and click publish okay usually when after you hit the publish the the review can be done like within maybe like less than two minutes from my experience of creating that and I'm just going to show you guys how you are able to retrieve that okay so right now I'm just going to put the cross close this window okay so how do you find your frame? Tap the camera icon in the Facebook app to open a camera. Okay, it's pretty, pretty, very, very easy. Can you guys see that it's instantly approved? 
Okay, so this is what I'm going to do. I have my phone right here with me. I'm just going to go to the Facebook logo. Oh, <laughs> okay. I'm just going to do a live um, in my profile, but then I'm going to do it in my group that I specifically created in order to do tests, okay? So this is where I want you guys to go after, okay? I want you to click on the live button. I'm not sure if Blessed can see. Here's, uh, here's the live button. Can you guys see that? Just click on the live button here, okay? So let me bring my screen bigger. This is where I was clicking. I was clicking the... Can you guys see? I was clicking the live button here, okay? Live button on the left. That is where there are a lot of options for you to pick, right? So, I want you guys to pick this star. This is a star, this button. And then over here, there is something that is frame. So just click on the frame. Okay, over here, you should be able to locate yours. Okay, that you just newly created. Where I found mine. Yes, exactly, I found mine. Can you guys see that? That's the logo I put just now. And then the I am amazing is at the bottom. That's the reason why I say that don't make it too uh, bottom because that's where you can't see. So here is the logo that I just put in. And then you're able to start live. Like it is so damn simple and it's like a crazy little hacks that I just found out. And you don't need to like set up OBS or anything else in order to have your logo and your social media handler on your Facebook live. Okay. But then uh, here's the thing that I couldn't find out is that um, I think it will work uh, when you are doing live in your Facebook mobile app. However, if let's say you are doing live in the desktop version, I couldn't see that solution available just yet. Maybe I do not know. So definitely you would want to join my Facebook group uh, at www.amazingstory.co so that whenever I have a little bit of updates regarding this method, I will definitely be there to share with you guys. And of course, for those out there, if let's say you are starting your Facebook live, and I have one free 30-day cheat sheet for you where it is a 30-day live video ideas just for you for free. If let's say you're interested to get a free copy, feel free to go to the link. I put it on the top. That is a link.junlo.co slash free 30. And remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel and I look forward to seeing you.